please do subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for more tutorial videos hello guys welcome back to the channel backbenches classroom i hope you guys all are well and guys in this video i'm going to show you how to turn your laptop or desktop computer into a web host server actually guys a web host server is a type of server that host or run websites okay which means you can develop and run your own website on your own laptop and desktop okay guys and guys you can access your developed website which is running on your local server from anywhere on the world by making it live so guys before start we have to download a software okay in the market there are many type of software among them two most widely used software is xamp and wamp so let's open the browser and then search for the wamp or xamp okay guys this is a xamp server even you can download wamp server both are same and guys as you can see here and guys as you can see here there are a lot of softwares which work same okay and guys i personally use xam server otherwise wam server here i am going to download xam server okay guys follow the steps to download xam server first choose the platform if you are windows user then choose for windows if you are using linux then choose for linux and if you are mac user then choose the last one so let's download the windows as you can see guys the download has started after complete the download just open this by clicking on it and start the installation as you can see the installation process has started click on yes button to proceed then click on okay and then click on next okay from here as you can see there are some services and guys if you don't need some services you can uncheck it and proceed for the installation okay and then click next button here guys the default installation location will remain same i'm not gonna change it now click on next button to continue as you can see guys it is giving an error message because i have already created a jam folder earlier so guys let's delete the folder by going to the path so let's open this jam folder by going to the source and then let's delete this okay now we have to click on next button to continue then click on next again and then click on next again okay so guys as you can see the installation has begin and guys we have to wait until the installation has finishes so i'm going to first forward this installation part okay As you can see guys the installation has completed now we have to click on finish button so guys after installation let's open the xamp okay so guys as you can see xamp control panel open it okay and here is our xamp interface and as you can see here are some services listed okay so guys if you want to develop any website then you must need to start this apache service click on start button to start that service and guys and guys if you want database in your website then you have to start this mysql service okay then click on start button to start that service okay now close this so guys our local server is ready now now we can deploy any website using this server okay guys now i will show you where to create the website okay so go to the installation location of xam server and remember this folder because guys if you want to develop a new website you have to develop inside this htdocs folder okay and as you can see here are some html files and other files are written here okay and inside the dashboard there are also html files okay so guys let's learn how to access local server open any browser okay now type 127.0.0.1 
this address is our local server address okay now hit enter to apply as you can see guys here is our dashboard means this folder and here as you can see a website or a page they are written and all the main source file is here okay and guys if you want to access database interface where you can create database then you have to click this php my admin option it will redirect to that folder and guys to start building your website you have to write your html and other files inside the htdocs folder and guys i will show you in my next video that how to add existing project or create a new project of website and also show you how to live your website till then take care and don't forget to subscribe the channel